Hi, everybody. Okay. It's me, Elle, and I'm hanging out in the studio, Ryan Cameron Show. I'm very excited because it's prom season, and this year, uh, I work with Enchanted Closet every year. Love Enchanted Closet, great charity. I hope you support them. They collect prom dresses from everyone uh, to try to give to underserved girls, women who may not be able to necessarily afford to go to prom, so they either have to wear secondhand stuff or, you know, they just don't go at all. So I love working with them. And we were like, you know what? Let's take it up a notch. Let's crown a Cinderella. There's a young lady here. She thinks that I brought all three finalists up. Um, she thinks that she's gonna have to kind of interview almost to win, but little does she know that we've got our scepter and our tiara and everything ready because she's the winner and she's gonna get a custom made dress and she's gonna get um, food and limo service and photos and hair and makeup. It's just gonna be amazing. We're taking everything. So she's sitting in the green room now and we'll bring her in in just a minute and we'll surprise her. So shh, we'll be sneaky though. Now back to our official business and uh, you know, I decided this year. I work with Enchanted Closet every year. It's a fabulous organization. We'll talk with Benita Johnson, who runs it. Uh, it's an organization that essentially, to put it shortly, um, gets prom dresses from across the city for Metro Atlanta girls who can't normally afford to go, underserved girls. Prom is very expensive. And it is a rite of passage, I feel like, for young women. I feel like they uh, should be able to go to prom if they want. Uh, so this year we decided to do Cinderella, which is I wanted to pick a girl, a very deserving girl, one specific girl to highlight because there's so many amazing girls who are part of Enchanted Closet, but one girl to highlight who would be dubbed the first annual Cinderella. There was three amazing contestants, and uh, of course this person's going to get a celebrity gown designed by Michael Knight. Specifically for them, this person's going to get hair and makeup taken care of. They're going to get dinner taken care of. I'm going to pay for their prom tickets, limo service. Everything you can think of for prom will be taken care of. And one of our contestants that we have here is Tanisha Lucas. Hello, Tanisha. Hello. How are you? I'm good. You, what about you? I'm doing wonderful. Good to see you. Now, you you found out about uh, the Cinderella program, and you actually emailed me yourself. Yes. Is that right? Tell everybody quickly your story, um, what you told me. My story is... Uh, I'm in 2% of my class. I have a 3.8, and recently I just had cervical cancer surgery, and I'm back at school. You're back at school. What was that like? And I've got Tanisha's mother here as well. What was that like finding out? I mean, you, you're doing everything right, and you're in school, and it's your senior year, and did you notice that you had a, a pain or? Just an abnormal pap smear. An abnormal pap. At 17 years old? Yes. Which you don't expect to, to hear right. about. It was devastating. And they told you then that... We had to go. She was in stage two, so we had to go ahead and do emergency surgery. What was that like for you to go in for something that women have done every year? I'm sure your mom told you from the time you were young, you'll I, get to an age and you'll do this, and then you find out you had cancer. I was scared, nervous, because I didn't know what to expect. Who was a good? Who was the best comfort for you during that time? My mother. She was there for you, huh? Through it all. Now, what was? You find out that you've got cervical cancer, and then and then what? I mean, obviously, I'm sure the, stage two, they wanted to jump on top of it, but what was the next move? We just, we just prayed about it, and we put it into God's hand, and we knew that he was going to take care of it because she had she have did so much, and she's a wonderful child and a wonderful student. She worked, varsity chili, she does everything right. So I knew, and we just prayed about it. Tisha, where you go to high school at? Washington High School. Washington High School. Okay. Been to Washington a couple of times. Why do you think that the people of Atlanta should vote for you to be this year's Cinderella? Because you have a great story. There are a lot of young girls who, who go through a lot and who deal with a lot and want to be Cinderella. Why should it be you? I think I should be Cinderella because it would make my mother happy. All the stress she'd been through with my surgeon and all. She'd be impressed. She'd be impressed. Okay, well, I, like I told you, uh, I brought you in and two of the other girls. We're going to inter interview each one of you individually yes. and figure out who's going to get this. But I lied to you because there are no other girls up here. Because you, Tanisha, are this year's oh. Cinderella. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, congratulations. <laughs> we've got to get, we've got a tiara for you. Let's get that on her. Yes, take your headphones off, honey. Take that headband <laughs> off. We got a scepter for you. You, honey, are going to custom make your own dress along with Michael Knight. Whatever you want. Anything that you want, he's going to make for you. You're going to have your hair and your makeup done professionally. Kissable Lips Cosmetics. Michelle, thank you. 
you were going to have limo service to dinner, to prom, and back home for you and your friends. You're going to have a $150 dinner gift certificate courtesy of Buckhead Life Restaurant. So thank you so much. Buckhead Life has the best restaurants in the city, and there's plenty to choose from. So you're going to love that. Uh, photos will be taken of you, professional photos that will come to you. We'll take all your shots, so you'll you'll be able to have that forever, a, a wonderful memory. I'm going to pay for your prom tickets, so you don't have to worry about that. Everything that you need, we're going to take care of for you. Tanisha. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank how you. do you feel? Mom, Good. how do you excited, feel? Excited, excited. This is it. You don't have to. I mean, how how expensive is prom? Have you been looking very, at it? And, and yes. you know, was it, was, did it seem doable? I'm sure with medical yes. bills and. Yes, <laughs> very expensive. Yes. So and we'll, I wanted her to have the perfect prom this year because she's just been a perfect child. She's been a perfect child and she deserves it. You've gone through a lot, but you're back at school. You still got straight A's. I'm, I'm really proud of you. I don't know you, but I think it's a great story. Uh, you, and I, mom said something that was really poignant that I'd like all the girls to hear, which is that you can still do everything the, the right way, and sometimes bad things still happen yes. to you and for you, but it's not it's not about uh, that. It's just about how you pick yourself back up, and you've just done an amazing job. I'm really proud to name Thank you Cinderella. You. Thank you. So we're going to get going, and uh, shout out to Benita Johnson. We'll talk to her in just a second, but Benita, uh, Enchanted Closet, we love you so very much, and yeah. Congratulations, okay? Thank you. Thank Tell everybody you. that I just named you Cinderella. Tell them the station, babe. Yeah, everybody just just named me Cinderella, and the station is B103. Yes, baby. Tanisha <laughs> Lucas, yay!